What's up, everybody? It is your boy King Ross here, and today for you guys, I'm back here with another video on my channel. Now, I'm not gonna put face cam on today, and the reason why is because we're gonna play a game called Plague Inc. Now, basically, if you guys have not heard of Plague Inc., it is a game where you can create your own disease or virus, sort of say, and you can spread. You can choose how you can spread it. You're supposed to kill everybody on Earth, and you can choose how you spread it, where you start to spread it, and basically literally everything else you can choose so we're gonna do that today we're gonna start a brand new game if you guys do watch and enjoy this make sure you smack that like button make sure you subscribe and if you want to see um another video on plague inc i will do another one but you guys have to leave a like let's go ahead and play i'm gonna do a new game for you guys warning starting a new game will overwrite your save continue yes and we're going to use a bacteria. Now, I want to warn you guys, I have not won a game yet. I have not won this yet. So we're going to go call our disease Robical. There we go, Robical. Start. All right, please wait while the game is loading. Now, welcome to Play Gang. Okay. So this time, I've started off in... Korea a couple times right over here. I have started off in Korea. I've started off in China and I have that's basically all I've started off in. So we're going to go ahead and start off in Africa this time, Central Africa. Boom. Robico begins in Central Africa. Robico has infected its first human. Weak but used to hot temperatures and must evolve using DNA points to infect more people. Okay. So, we're supposed to kill everybody on Earth, and if you can see, there's over 7 billion people on Earth that we must kill. And uh, here's the cure. If they get, if the cure down here, above the world map, above the world button, gets to 100%, that that means that you have been beaten and you basically lost. So, we're going to try to get a win. So, let's see if we can do so. Let me actually lower this volume. There we go. Me and my un my uncle actually told me about this. Shout out to him. I'm not going to leave his name because, I mean, it's a little bit risky to leave his name. So, his name is Raheem Smith, but don't try to look at him up yet. Um, we're going to try and get a couple more things filled out. And then you guys can look him up. Okay. Um, but, yeah, he told me about this game, and I, I, I really wanted to try it on video, so that's what I'm doing today. Ten people, it's infected. Alright, so let's see what we can do first. Transmission. We really can't do anything, really. Robico begins to spread. Robico is spreading from person to person in Central Africa, and we'll go, and potentially, you control the plague indirectly by evolving it. So we can add, we can make it stronger. We can make it. We can make our disease stronger. We can make it faster. We can make it um make people die quicker. We can do a lot in this game, and I really like it. So we're gonna go into disease. We're gonna do a transmission, and I want this to flow through via air one, because everybody breathes air. Upgrade lets airplanes be infected again. The air transmission upgrade lets Robico avoid the new air filters on airplanes and spread between countries again. Okay. So that way we get more people infected. You have successfully evolved Robico. You're, you have spent DNA points to evolve your disease and more options have opened up. Get more points by popping DNA and biohazard bubbles and infecting people all right so this is literally basically all we have to do is just kill everybody on earth so we're just gonna wait for another bubble to pop up as you guys can see these red dots in africa they represent the amount of people that the disease has spread to. And the amount of people infected. 
Korean border guards plan strike. 50,000 border guards are threatening to strike and disrupt traffic in the former DMZ to, due to poor employment prospectus. Okay. And another thing about this game is it's actually real life. So just like there's a North and South Korea in real life and there's a demilitarized zone between them, I'm going to show you guys what the demilitarized zone is. So you see Korea's right here and you see that little line right in the middle between it? That's a DMZ. This game is actually based off of real life. So anything that you can see in real life is most likely in this game. Um, we're going to go ahead and do Air 2. Rabical infects hundreds. Rabical has infected hundreds in Central Africa, increasing the chance of an infected infected person will infect a healthy person. Keep evolving your disease. All right. So we're going to keep on evolving our disease. So here you can see how many people are infected in red. In white, you can see how many people are dead. You can, under um, dead people, you can see the cure has reached 0%. Under infected, you can see the DNA points that we've reached that we can spend to make our disease faster, stronger, whatever we want. The disease under that is what we can spend in the world is to see <clears throat> our current progress. And the bubbles that pop up give you DNA points. They slow down the cure process for people that are trying to cure, that are trying to cure everybody. And um, I believe there's one more, but I cannot remember exactly what it's for. Arabical is spreading. All right. I believe we can go infect thousands. Arabical has infected thousands of people in Central. Okay. Let's go here. Symptoms. Now we can go coughing, rash, nausea, um, insomnia, crisis, I believe. And I don't know what that says. We're going to go insomnia. And paranormia that. Okay. So I believe that we can do this. Rabical spreads to East Africa. East Africa has been infected. Your disease has taken an important step in becoming a plague. When a new country is infected, pop the red bubble to get DNA points. Alrighty. There are a lot of people being infected right now. There we go. There's a lot to do in this game, guys, I'm telling you. Um, we can make it also infect via animals. So we can do... Um, I'd rather do water one. That way, it's in people's drinking water. Severe storm strike and Anoglia. Severe storm strike heavily populated area in a an Agolia, who analysts warn a, of a crop and property damage. There is over a thousand people infected on the world. All right, let's tap those. Get um DNA points. Over 100,000 people infected, over 300 people dead. Rabical infecting more countries. Rabical is infecting more countries. Control where it goes by involving transmission traits in disease menu. Transmission. Um, okay, when we get the when we get the DNA points, we're gonna do livestock one. That way, where people are. And peep in places where there are a lot of animals and farms and stuff, they can be infected as well. That's basically what that means. Let's pop up these DNA points. And we're going to go to transmission. We're going to do livestock one. Boom. 
Heavy flooding in Brazil. Heavy flooding has occurred in Brazil. Who analysts warn of severe damage of national biotech industry and research facilities. Over a million infected right now. And over 600 dead. Geez, Central Africa is being infected fast. More infectious than TB. Wow. Dang, Russia's big. I didn't know Russia was that big. Nausea symptom mutated. Robical has mutated a develop and nausea symptom without using DNA points. Okay, we might make that stronger. So let's see, symptoms, um, where's nausea? Nausea, nausea. Um, I don't know where nausea is. I don't, where's nausea? Oh, there's nausea. Jeez. Over 33 million people dead. In, in Central Africa. I mean infected. I'm sorry. Look at this big patch of red, you guys. That's how many people are infected right now. This big patch of red. Look at that. It's popping up fast, too. Jeez, it's popping up fast. Over 100 million dead. Central Africa starts work on cure. Central Africa is the first to instruct doctors to begin research into a cure for Robical. Without greater funding, it is expected to take a long time. So, Africa, I suggest, is the best place to strike because it has less medical care. So, you can easily strike it. And we started in Central Africa, too, so... It's gonna spread really quickly. By the way, huge sponsor, huge shout out to my sponsor, MCA Motor Cup of America. If you don't know, my uncle is actually a um, entrepreneur and he is actually a business owner, so he is in Motor Cup of America as well. Go check his channel link out in the description below. Um, huge shout out to my sponsors, MCA. Thank you so much for sponsoring this video. Just look at all that red that's popping up. That, that's crazy. At one point, you can pretty much make the entire map red if you wanted. Alright, so since we have 15 transmission, I want to go ahead and do insect. Because I think that an insect would likely transmit it way faster than air or water could. We can still transmit it by air and water, but it would be it'll be transmitted by um insects too. So if like a tick lands on your body, then it'll spread the thing. Look at this. Look at all that red there. Geez, that's a lot of red. You can see down in the bottom right where it says cure, you can see a little patch of blue there. That's how much they worked on it since since um the thing has started. Boom. It's a good thing we started in Africa too. That way more people can freaking die. And if you guys can see this red line right here, that's where um, the disease has traveled to. The disease has traveled there. Medicine in UK slowing infection. UK is wealth. UK is a wealthy country with high quality healthcare. To spread faster, you you may need to involve the drug resistance ability. All right, abilities, drug resistance. 
There we go. We've done, we've done the drug resistance ability. Got another bubble there, and we might want to do it one more time, can we? No. Okay, we can do this one. See how many people we have infected right now in the red? And see how many people we have dead right now in the white? Now it has spread to Australia. The bug has spread to Australia. Wherever that little red thing goes that you see moving there, that's where we have to pop the bubble. I think. Yes. So as you guys can see, the disease is spreading very rapidly. I mean very rapidly. It is spreading around the world. This is crazy. We've got almost all of Africa infected with our disease. Rash symptom mutated. Okay. So now people get rashes by getting it. Boom. So really, Africa is spreading the disease to the world. Africa is spreading the disease. There are a lot of them popping up. Sheesh. Africa has, has infected the world. I don't want to hear it. It has infected the world. Jeez, there are over a billion dead. Let's go ahead and spend some points here. So we can evolve that. And we can involve that. Can we involve anything else? Oh, uh, we can involve that. There we go. Oh my god, look at Africa. There's only one patch of green left. <laughs> and look at this land now. It's starting to become infected more. We have over a billion people infected and 600 people dead still. Holy shoot. There are only nine people infected in Russia. This disease is spreading, yo. Look at Africa. It's just a bit. Africa at this point is just a red blob on the map. That's at this point. That's all it is. Just a red blob on the map. A little it Easter egg there. Rapico placed on watch list. Rapico has been placed on the watch list on the Who watch list. Although not very dangerous, governments warn that a more deadly strain could have could appear. Oh hell yeah, you better believe it. Uh, abilities, material resistance. Let's evolve that. More infections than the common cold. Soon, guys, the every place on the map will just be a red blob. Iraq is starting cure research. It's infected India now. And literally the whole of South America. The beeping you hear in the background is just the hospitals that are taking care of so many patients. Three billion people infected. Three billion. Russia leading global cure effort.
those blue bubbles are to help to stop the to speed to slow down the process of of cure. Let's go ahead. Transmission. Bird one. Bird two. And rodent one. Vomiting symptom mutated. Almost 4 billion people infected. Russia shuts down airports. Damn. You guys see this right now, right? Wow, this is crazy. Four over four billion people dead, or um, infected. Look at China. Oh my God, look at China. Damn, look at China. Yo, there are nobody dying, though. It's been 600 people dead for, like, five minutes. Nobody's dying, but everybody's infected. I should try and make it more lethal. Abilities. Cold resistance, two. Material resistance, three. Shuffle, two. Um, this one, let's see. Heat resistance. Look at Mexico. Oh my God, look at Mexico. Look at Florida. I live in Florida and I'm infecting, I'm infecting Florida even though I live there. Sorry for all you guys that live in Canada, but in the next game, Canada is next. I'm sorry, but Canada is next. Kennedy just has to be next. I'm sorry. First death in Central Asia. Dang, over three, over eleven. Dang, the people are dying. The people, people are dropping like fries at fries. People are dropping like flies at this point. Flies. If it keeps going at this rate, we might as well just say goodbye to the Earth. Over a million people dead. Dang. All right, we got to make this um, worse. Transmission, symptoms, sweating, skin lecitions, whatever that is. And I believe that's all we can do for right now. Dang, people are dropping like fries. Why do I keep saying fries? I must be hungry. People are dropping like flies. Oh yeah, 25% cure. If it reaches 100, then we've basically lost. In Russia, over 16 mil, 17 mil, 20 million people infected. Okay, amnesia, amnesia, whatever that is. Dang. Sheesh, you guys. This is wow. Robical is global. The cure for Robical will be available in 271 days. I've killed over 5 million people. 6 million people are infected. I have 204 million people left to go.
West Africa shuts down land borders. Poland starts Central Corps disposal. Over 7 million dead. Let's see the world. Oh, yeah, I have only 95 million more to go. In Iceland. Wow. Look at Russia. Damn, there are over seven, there were eight million people dead. Take a look at the world again. Sixty-two million more to go. Iceland begins to break down. Pretty much the entire right side of the map is pretty much dead. Like literally everybody. Damn, forty-seven million more. I don't think we're going to make it, but hey, let's see if we can kill everybody on Earth. They're, fi they're trying to find the cure. To be honest, I don't think they're going to do it. I think we're just going to kill everybody on Earth and just leave it at that. Seven billion people infected. 42 million more to go. We can do this. 50% cured. To be honest, I think we're just going to kill human life. Symptoms, transmission. We've pretty much done everything we can literally do. I believe. Yeah, we've pretty much done everything we can do. To kill the world. 36 million more people. I don't think we're going to make it, but let's see. Because this is exciting. Tropical mutation patterns. Extraordinary. Scientists are struggling to understand the extraordinary mutation patterns of radical. Who researchers say that this setback will damage cure efforts? Man. So that basically means you're not going to be able to kill everybody. World. Oh, yeah, we totally got this. We've literally totally got this. Like, look at the red compared to the blue. Kira? Yeah. I don't think they're going to make it. I don't think they're going to make it, but let's see. I have how many more people left to go? I have 28 million left to go. Wait, what the hell just happened to my game? That was awkward. Pretty much all human life is infected. Well, except Canada. There are still a couple million more to go. Ooh, I don't think we're going to make it. We have 20 million more. Come on. Saudi Arabia sets up trauma centuries. They're pretty much shipping the cure all over the world. Eye care device announced. Apple Soft announced a new eye care device to help cure Robocall. Release date TBD. Wow. I'm so scared. 13 more people more to go. The The map is pretty much a blob of blood right now. Man. Can we do it, guys? Can we do it? Can we literally do it? I don't think so. I don't think we can do it. There are no more healthy people left in the world. The last healthy person on the planet recently became infected with Robocall. So that basically means we won? Yeah, there's zero people left on Earth. Literally zero people. Let's see the news. Yeah. 
Inflammation symptom mutated. Okay. Yeah, there are no healthy people left on Earth. Literally no one. Disease points. Water too, okay. We need a lot more um points. Seventy five percent complete. Do we literally need to kill any more people? Like how many more people do we need to kill? Cause it says here that everyone's dead or at least infected. Do we need to turn those infected people into dead people, I'm assuming? Yeah, I'm assuming so. We need to turn those infected people into dead people. But I really don't think that's gonna happen. In time. But at least we tried, right? <laughs> at least we tried. Did I make oh my god, I made this video 30 minutes long. Dang. Are you guys even gonna watch this entire video? Wow. 33 million people dead. That's a lot of people. Gotta say. Jeez. Everybody's infected. We just need to turn them dead. That's all we need to do. Is just make them die. Are we gonna do it today, guys? Let's see. I'm waiting to see. I'm really interested if we're gonna kill everybody. I really doubt it. Yeah, we don't even have close to the amount of people we need dead. We need to kill everybody on Earth. Norway closes all public buildings. I cure a failure. People with Robocar are sweating so much that the I care touch screens break. Wow. Wow. Canada closes all public buildings. Wow. Killed more than the Black Death. New statistics show that Rabbitoh has killed over 75 million people worldwide. Worse than the Black Death. What is the Black Death? Hmm. Everybody's closing all public buildings due to radical. Egypt closes all public buildings. 95. The film will begin shortly. We definitely lost this, but hey. It's just for fun, right? Yeah, just for fun. The Philippines closes all public buildings. Yeah, we lost this one. We almost had it, though. Like, we literally almost had it. Yeah, it's 100%. We almost had it. I believe that I can do it. We almost had it, though. We almost had that. Okay, it's the being, the Rabical is being deployed worldwide. And le and you can start seeing an infected people, less and less people are becoming infected. But more and more people are dying. So can that number reach seven million? Oh, three million people are back. Wow. Three million people came back. Rabical become Rabical becoming scary. The more scary Rabical becomes by hurting and killing people, the harder humans will try to cure it. Remember, this when evolving your diseases. Okay. But if you guys did, in fact, and see how all the red is disappearing now? All the red is starting to disappear. But if you guys did watch and enjoy this episode, 
of Plague Inc. And you guys do want to see another episode of this. Make sure you do subscribe. Make sure you do like this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.